it's Misty and this is part two to my Black Friday haul and as you know if you if you watch part one um, everything that was in part one and what I'm about to show you I saved nearly um, over six hundred dollars um, so like six, around six hundred and fifty dollars and I spent under two hundred for everything so that's like a huge huge savings so I'm really excited. So this is some of the bigger items that I got. And um, this one right here is kind of big. It's really hard to show you. So let's see if I can... Okay, there you go. Um, I got this organizer right here. Which this one is normally um, near $40. So I'm really excited, uh, excited that I got it for um, probably around $12, I think. Um, somewhere right around there. So that was um, a really good savings and then actually I think it was less than that I think it was more like 10 but anyway so um, and then the largest part of my purchase for money wise was um, these Cricut cartridges they were um, I spent a hundred dollars just on these cartridges so if you can imagine everything else I got and how much I saved now these are normally $89.99 but they were on um, a doorbuster for $24.99 at Michael's. And I got these ones. These were my favorite. They had a ton. And these are just really neat and different. This one's called Ribbons and Rosettes. And it just makes these gorgeous rosettes. And it has the centers. And then you can also use, um, like the, if you see like on the edges here, you can also use those on to make like a border on the end of a page. Or it also will turn it into an actual like a ribbon, like a die cut um, border. So really cool. And it has like, look at all those different ones. Those are all the different ones that it does. And it's just so cool. So it does, um, it does big borders. It does tiny borders um, or like medium borders. It does a lot of different types of borders. And then... Um, it even has, and then it does the centers to all the the rosettes too. It has a whole bunch of really cool centers, which you could use those centers as regular die cuts as well. And then I got this one is the ornamental iron two, and it does these really cool iron, like just really really cool. I love this one, and it even has a font setting. So it has an entire font plus um, different laces and and it's just really really neat. And then this one here is the Damask Decor. And this one is really cool. You see all the different Damask. There, there's a ton on there. And so you can um, put it on envelopes. It does envelopes, tags, cards. Um, it does silhouettes layer and it does two different layers so you get a lot of options with all of these and for like the tags you can like see right there it actually cuts it out of the tag and then it makes envelopes and it actually makes turns the damask into a card so that's really cool and then this one here is sophisticated and none of these I have ever heard of before and I was really surprised so these are really cool and then this one here has some really neat stuff. It has tons of keys, and it has clocks, and it has um, um, like die cuts and frames, and then it has um, crowns, and just tons of cool. It even has tons of different chandeliers too. And this one here does the. It also has a two different font sets, and it does um, borders. And it has some phrases, and it does um, some of the really cool shadowing as well. So I'm really excited about this cartridge. So these are full content cartridges for $24.99. And this one here is um, Teresa Collins, too. And I didn't even know Teresa Collins um, designed any credit cartridges. So that's really awesome. So um, the last, last few things I have... And so, um, I got these. I had gotten these the last time, I think it was the last time I had gone. And these were $1.99, and I'm using these to, um, store all my mat stacks. So I have four of these now, and once the mat stacks are in there, you can just stack them on top of each other. It's kind of hard to see. There you go. 
you know, you can just stack them on top of each other. So, I got those. I got two of those. And then I have the, um, a little filer, a cube filer, uh, file box, and, um, which is by, um, Jetmax. It's, you know, one of those cubes that they make, but it's actually a little filing cabinet. And so, I went and just got a couple of these files, because these stuff were 50% off, plus an additional 30 So, I got this one here, and this is by Scrap Paper Scissors. And these ones are just the, the big 12x12, 12 12, um, file folders. And it is a six-pack. And then I also got, um, some more of the, oops, sorry, some of the actual dividers. And, and these ones are the hanging, um, file folders. And... So these are six pieces, so I got that. And then I have tons of paper. So we're already like over five minutes, or we're at six minutes. And so I just wanted to quickly show you um, all the paper pads I got. I ended up, and I also got seven paper pads, guys. So yeah, like, I did like so awesome if I got organizers and tons and tons of little goodies, embellishments, um, and then seven paper pads, so that's awesome. This one right here is probably one of my favorite. This one is by Recollections, and it's the Regent Street. And this paper is just... I'm going to have to kind of show it sideways. It'll be easier. This paper is just so cool. Oops. I mean, like, it just... It's like a mixture. It has some sewing, and it has some more intricate stuff, and then some things that are more like... um. I would say for guys, and then it has girls stuff, so it's a very interesting pack. And then it has like just some really cool newsprint, maybe if I just zoom in just a little bit. So it has newsprint, it's this really pretty pattern, and then look at that guys, like oh my goodness. And it has a lot of that like little resist on there, so when you color over it you won't, um, you know, color the actual image if you wanted to change the color in the background or something. And you get two of each sheet. And this one has top hats. I hope it's not bothering you guys to be showing it sideways, but it's kind of just how I have to do it. And some of it will be a little upside down, too. But, um, yeah, just really cool, cool paper. I'm just loving this. So, um... Really pretty colors and little um, patterns. It kind of is like, um, some of it reminds me a little bit of Tim Holtz too. And then this is really, really neat here. I don't know if you can see that. There we go. So that's really cool. And then it has um, just a ton of really cool papers. This one here is really cool too. It has little tags on the bottom. So that's um, pretty much it for the Regent stack. And then I got the Holiday Traditions. And um, this one is really cool too. So, oops. This is like one of my favorite paper packs for Christmas. It's really, really neat. I mean, very pretty. Look at that. I mean, just gorgeous paper. And this is a full 12 by 12 too. And you get two of each. Oops. Okay, so that's pretty much the Holiday Traditions by Recollections. And then this one here is the Oh Christmas Tree. And this one's also by Recollections. Let me just take this off real quick. Okay, so... This one's a really nice paper pad, too. Ah, it keeps falling. Sorry, guys. This one's really pretty. trying to go through it. It's, it has glitter and embossing. It's just a really cool paper pad. Okay, so 
that one is the O Christmas tree. And then this one here is kind of neat. And this one's also a wintery um, paper pad too. And it's called the Ballet. And which is a little different. It's it's really cool. And it's all like, you know, girly but Christmassy and wintery. And this one's really, that's music notes if you can't tell. And then um, it's got like the Nutcracker and... It's just really cute paper. Oops, and it's very glittery. A lot of the pages have glitter on it. And I love this one. This is one of my favorite. Okay, I kind of showed you that up to down. Sorry. And then it's got a, a lot of nice tags and stuff. So that's the ballet by Recollections. And then this one here is um, Naughty or Nice by Recollections. And I was actually told... Oops! Oh my goodness, I just ripped the front cover. I was actually told that um, this is actually... Um, like a, some of it's from My Mind's Eye. I guess My Mind's Eye is starting to make some of the Recollection papers. And so to me it looks very My Mind's Eye, but they said it's... Um, they have a My Mind's Eye paper pad that's exactly the same. So, um, this is just a gorgeous. Like, oh my goodness. This is my absolute favorite Christmas pad ever. I really like that other one I showed you, but this one is absolutely, like, oh my goodness, guys, look. I mean, if you know My Mind's Eye, you know how gorgeous the paper is. Okay, sorry for the camera, but let's see if I can move it some. If that helps at all. Probably not. Okay. So, there's that one. And I got two of these paper pads because I liked it so much. And you get two of each of the patterns. And so that one, really pretty. And then the last one. Very, very nice. Okay, and then for the very last paper pad, um, this one is... Um, actually, okay, never mind. I only got six paper pads. This one's an older paper pad. I just happened, somehow it got in the stack for my haul video. Okay, so you guys, that's pretty much it. Um, so, yeah, about those two videos, about, you know, 13 minutes long. But, um, so you guys, definitely, like, next year, check out your stuff for your Black Friday sales. Because you won't want to miss them. And it was on Thanksgiving. So you kind of just go like a little, like after dinner, because I believe every year they do it 4 to 10 on Thanksgiving, they have a 30% 30 30 off coupon, and so that's like the best deal that you can get on all your stuff. So you guys have a wonderful, happy holidays, and I will talk to you later, bye!